my people, my people. Yo, how we doing on this lovely Wednesday night? I just enjoyed the hell out of this week's uh, AEW Dynamite. Yo, what's up, Demon? Are oh, you joining the Discord? Oh, I see ya. Okay. Armament. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, so if you could just in the... Oh, also, hello. Well, hello. Nice to meet you. I'm Juggernaut. Welcome to the mob. Um, if I could just have you write in chat a number between 1 and 18. <laughs> oh, shit! Yo, hell yeah up in this bitch. Oh, no, it's Brock. No, be quiet. I'm going to give you another shout out because I was not fast enough to pause the music. Hold on. Hold on. Hello there. Oh, hello. Three A's, three H's. Um, pause check. Thank you. <laughs> he said, hey, follow me. <laughs> that fucking laugh, my God. Oh, shit, man. You're going so cheap right now with a Spitfire and a fucking alternator. Oh my god. Ooh. My bad. Uh, that was hysterical. Alright, and OP car, you get <laughs> seven. Let me do myself a quick favor because this music is blasting in my ear. And turn that back up. That's why everything was off. God damn. <clears throat> so yeah, so lucky seven. What is the hot sauce, Adam? <laughs> well, we gotta um, we gotta clear out the the beans first. We got six beans. The hot sauce is on the way. Just <laughs> yo, bossing it hit with ads. Girl, is that my cat? Hang on. Oh, God. oh ads, ads, ads. God damn. You usually put six beans in your ass. That's not nice. <laughs> uh, but yeah. Anyways, number seven. Ooh, X morph defense. That one, I think, looked interesting, if I recall. I just DM'd it to you, uh, OP. Sweet ears are bleeding. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah, I kind of figured that out a little too late. Um, she'll pay me for the time they have wasted. First time sharing that name. <laughs> uh, so yeah, so that's that one. And then, let's see. Um... So for those who weren't here, such as OP or any other people that are new, um, although OP knows now, so we're doing a giveaway right now, and we have seven left plus ten I'm going to be giving away. <laughs> so I'm back, no more ads. <laughs> so yeah, so if you haven't followed yet, now's the time to follow and join my Discord to get a free Steam game. Or if you got 500 biddies, or if you sub or gift a sub, you're getting a free fucking Steam game. It's a good deal. Uh, was this a clip with my cat? I have no idea. It looked like you were playing a game. <laughs> um, but yeah. So, pardon moi. Um, we also do something else here, which is awful. I can't wait until it's over. Rage stream. <laughs> um... We're also doing beans, and it's... Why? Oh, there we go. So yeah, so every three subs, like collectively, um, I have to eat one of these spicy-ass jelly beans. We got six left of them, and I can't wait till they're gone. Why does my mouse keep double-clicking? Hmm. Weird. And your, your camera had the cat? I didn't even see it. <laughs> To be honest, but that's fucking hilarious. Only good you play? Oh, God. <laughs> the Apex one, the Car X one. Oh, I must have missed the Car X one, I think. Rip my mouse. No. No. I don't want beans. I don't. We've replaced it. You know what? Tell you what. Let me pull it up here. On the good old interwebs. What's this fucking thing called again that I got today? I have to go look it up my Discord. I already forgot. 
<sighs> my brain. I'll bring all the beans. No, no more beans. The beans are gross. I'm gonna give you subs to keep a jelly bean in your nose the whole stream. Um, I can't guarantee anything because my nostrils are pretty big, but my sinuses are really small, so they'd probably just fall right out. Bad. I'm the baddest motherfucker in the world. Oh Why shit! Hooli's <laughs> back. Three months subscription, bro. Thank you. Slug wee wee to yourself. <laughs> uh, Hooli, you get a free game too. Uh, game me number between one and seventeen. Um, and I'm also looking for what the fuck I was just talking about. Um, there it is. Purebred idiot hot sauce roulette. <laughs> Let me pull up this fucking picture real quick. Alright. I want a free game. You know what to do. I already told you how to do it. Um, really quickly. This right here, actually, can I get a fucking image, a new tab, please? And like, let's fucking zoom in on this bitch. Okay, there we go. So yeah, so this thing here is literally a rule. It's not a really a roulette wheel. It just looks like one. Uh, but there's a spinner on it. And it spins around in a circle and it's going to select a hot sauce that I basically have to drink. This is going to replace the beans. Um, some of them are fucking horrendous the amount of shit that are in them and other ones seem like okay this actually might taste good so it's a complete luck of the draw oh jesus christ all the beans are coming <laughs> another sub thank you I believe we're one away from a bean because i haven't heard randy marsh yell at me yet let me turn this up a bit just in case we get uh him yelling the trinidad scorpion one is too much yeah that's gonna probably kill me put it on chips um, and then on top of that, on top of that, um, so two things. If you look at your channel points right now, right, um, you'll see at the very top, uh, there's a new channel point reward. So as opposed to you spending it all on spamming Howard D noises all night or, you know, other strange things. You can actually give up to, I believe it's 2,000 points a day. I see we're already raising it. It went from 0 to 2% in 30 seconds. Thank you. Um, if in 30 days we raise 250,000 channel points, I'll do a rage stream. Um, I, I can't promise it's going to be good content, but... Ah! <laughs> a tree and Lord will go right for it. Okay, great. Um, shit, the hype train is close, too. Chugga, chugga, what? So... Let me get, where the fuck is it? Okay, this is the other thing I wanted to look up. So, the other thing, we have a follower goal now uh, with an actual prize behind it. We're at 310, I think, right now, or something like that. I have so many channel points to give you, but <laughs> only 2,000 max a day. I couldn't change that. It wouldn't let me. You have 100K to donate. <laughs> when I put all 75,000 of my channel points into there right now, you can't, it's a limit. Um, so if we get to 500 followers or 313 right now, I am going to take this thing. Man, I'm baddest motherfucker in the world. Oh, son of a bitch. Oh God, here it comes. Oh, hot, 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 My God, must be over a hundred currents. Dad, are you all right? Yeah, I'm. Oh. No, I'm good. Feel a lot better. Okay, that's lovely. So this guy here is the world's hottest gummy bear. One singular red gummy bear. And what that's gonna do is I then have to mix it up with a bunch of other regular red gummy bears and I have to pop them in my mouth consistently as I cut a wrestling promo against other streamers. Um, gonna be terrifying. So anyways, I'm very scared. Yeah, thank you, hell yeah, for the fucking sub, man. Yeah, Demon, the number's broken. We don't go by the number. <laughs> I, put, I, I mentioned it a few times. It's just busted, so. I'm stalling, can you tell? Because there's one jalapeno and then there's 
five cayennes. <laughs> Cucumber flavored bean. Yes! I got the jalapeno! <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. That one's for fun. <laughs> Cucumber. <laughs> I can maybe choke on it. <laughs> but. Because I'm not going to bullshit you. Like, you played Russian Roulette, and you literally died on the first trigger pull. <clears throat> so, I feel bad. I'm going to feel worse in a second. Ugh. I don't want the extreme version. I don't want to taste dog food. Mr. Roy did that. He ended up getting sweaty gym socks. Nah. Oh, an extreme version of the jelly beans? Oh, ugh. No. Uh. I just have to chew it up, man. There's two beans. Call me titties. Boston. It ain't that serious, man. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. See, it's not that the cayenne tastes bad. It just doesn't taste good. So it's in the middle for a reason. Still hot. Oh. <laughs> Alright, hold on. I feel bad. I didn't even come back here. Not that you want to see my ugly fucking face, but... So, yeah. that's Those are our plans of late. Um, so, beans are running low. We got four left. You know, we're going to... Uh, <clears throat> going to replace that. 500 sub... Uh, sorry, 500 sub. What the fuck? 500 follower goal is in place. Um, rage stream for channel points. First fire pit night? Very soon, hopefully. I just moved the fucking thing, too. Um, but we also have the giveaway still going. For those who didn't know about the giveaway, here, spam the chat. Um, weather is getting better. Ha! Beat you to it. But thank you. <clears throat> Without you for what? Um, and then also, last time out, Kois ended up dropping a total of 10 subs. Ugh. You show up to the fire pit. <laughs> I don't care. Um, so, he didn't want the games. <clears throat> Beans. Oh, thank you, Tree, for the fucking biddies. We're on to level two of the hype train. What a fucking boss. Now, he had the ten keys. And he wants to get rid of them because he doesn't want to use them. And I said, all right, fine, I'll give them away randomly into the chat. Get your fingies ready. Hopefully you're not on mobile. If you are, get to a PC. Because right now, in chat, you will find... Batman Arkham City Game of the Year Edition Steam Code right there. Or more like it's over there. <clears throat> Go grab that. Throw it into your Steam account to redeem it. First one who does it gets it. <clears throat> Oh, and make sure you tell me if you got it, because I want to know. You've started something that will probably haunt you forever. Oh, God. What do you... Oh, you got it? Nice, Lord of the Lou. 
And what are you snitching about, Boston? I'm not snitching about anything. <clears throat> um, all right, that drops down to nine, so I'm holding track of that. All right. Shit. It is already 1040 Eastern. Um, already with Batman game is fucking free. Yeah, dude, Arkham City was a good one, though. Counterfeit copies of games. It's not counterfeit. Um, this one I actually had. So I actually got... Um, have you ever played it even before? Oh, Arkham City is really good. Arkham Asylum is the first one. City is second. Um, I can't remember the other ones. But those are the two really good ones. So, Game Pass isn't free. Your parents pay for it. You shut your mouth, demon. <laughs> um, yeah, I highly recommend the Batman series. I haven't played it. I'm not forging game codes. So, I bought a Humble Bundle last week. Um... To raise money for the Ukraine. It had like 120, 130 odd games. So I was going through getting all this, all those Steam codes. And I found a bunch of other ones I had from like legit 5 to 9 years ago was the rage. So I threw them all that I didn't want or didn't need into this list. And I've just been giving them out for like the last, I don't know, 2-3 weeks. <clears throat> so I mean... I mean, you could you could ask Lord Ulu send you a DM on Discord of him playing the game or some shit. <laughs> I definitely they're not they're not crap. I'm giving her out real shit. Um, but anywho, I think it's time to play some Alien Cube because I really want to beat this game and be uh, be on to the next fun surprise. Let's go. I thought I would have hit continue already. I guess I didn't. You know what? I bet you the sound is fucked up too. Give me one second. Mm -hmm. While well, this is loading, perfect timing. Where are you? Yep. Knew it. <clears throat> you bought it, you're, <laughs> bought it yourself, bitch. <laughs> Bro, why are you so angry? All right, just let me know if um, if any volumes are too off, and I'll just I'll try to play with it. Otherwise, we're sitting here loading the game back at Edgar's. I said back at Edgar's. Still, that's good. Oh Jesus. I gotta turn that back up. Oh! JK. Yo, it is awfully foggy up in this bitch. First, I'm looking for clues in the apartment. I have to find a safe place to hide the cube. Um, in the trash? <laughs> Newspaper. I don't want to read all that. Mr. and Mr. Mitchell disappearance deepens. I have to read it for story. <clears throat> I, know, I know why you said that. Uh, one month after Edgar Mitchell's disappearance, the police have identified his pro uh, probable whereabouts at the time of his disappearance. This thought to have been the family cabin, a small building deep in the mountains at an altitude of 1,500 meters. The building was found completely destroyed by fire. The search team's arrival in the area has been practically difficult due to the particularly difficult due to the recent heavy snowfalls. The cabin can only be reached on foot via steep and challenging mountain paths. Yo. Calm down. <laughs> the cabin can only be reached on foot via steep and challenging mountain paths, which are very dangerous to walk in at this time of the year. According to Detective De Damiano, the dynamics of the blaze are clear. The fire appears to have started in the fireplace, which had been left unattended for a long time. Morons. Abundant traces of blood have been found in front of the cabin. That's suspicious. Suggests that Edgar was wounded probably because of the blaze itself. However, following the trace left by him leaning towards the woods provided no clues because, although initially clearly visible, they found to disappear unexplainably in the vicinity of the cabin. He probably bandaged himself. Jesus. Another mystery complicates the case still further. Edgar's traces are the only ones observed at the site. Shock. The police have found other tracks next to his, but their origin and shape are unclear. 
Detective Damiano was not at liberty to divulge too much information, but he described the footprints as having been made by something huge and very heavy. Lord. Today the search has been suspended because of the bad weather that suggested there is little chance of finding Edgar still alive in the mountains, where the temperature is currently well below freezing. <clears throat> that man's dead. Okay. Um, where am I going to hide this thing? Not there. Right. Why is this door... First we find a place... Ah! <laughs> So it begins. Jesus. Uh, I can't hide in this apartment. They'll find it immediately. What is... What the fuck? Did you guys see that? The fucking slender man up here in this shit. Tried what? Oh, tried to... Time it right now. Alright, so I can't hide it in either of those two rooms. And none of these doors open. None of those things open. Why do I fucking hide it? Oh, upstairs is now open. I just noticed that. What's up here? Glad the aliens are talking to me because this is obnoxious. Yo, hold up. Where the fuck are we going right now? This place looks sketchy as shit. In a box. I'll have to keep here until I do my research at Edgar's apartment. I might find the answers I've been looking for there. I'm sure the way that it called me can call almost anybody, I'm supposing. So. <laughs> oh. Motherfucker. Oh, there's bullshit. How do I use my flashlight? I don't remember. Uh, there is no flashlight. Well, great. I can't see a fucking thing. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck with this game? What the fuck with this game? That had to be one of the biggest jump scares in a long time. Uh, Diz's PC building was fantastic. Uh, hello, Satan. How are we today, sir? I don't know if you just got in here or not, but something hysterical just happened. Well... Not hysterical to me. To everybody else in chat, I'm sure. Oh yeah, I've already read this. Get out of here. Dark vision is off, bro. What is this, the bean discussion? Oh god. Eh. Why are doors moving? Right. Ugh. Why does this sound wetter than it did before? Can I fucking... Thank you. Okay. <sighs> yeah, I still can't open that from either side, really. Terrible smell. Yep, I remember saying that before. Strange creature. Oh yeah, right. I can't move because I have nothing. It's nothing I can. I don't have anything that can do that. Mm. Oh no, he's sir. <laughs> the thunderclaps look zero bit cost gunshots. <laughs> Jesus Christ. 
Christ, Boston. Oh, I don't know if I want to open the trap door. That does not sound good at all. And then this thing, I don't know what to do. You put the statuette there. Oh. What are you doing over here? All right, rotate. Nope. There are two more shots at it. I'll get you one of these days. <laughs> oh, gee. Thanks, Satan, for contributing, you monster. All right, so it didn't work for any of those things. I didn't really remember, like, that's weird, there's no handle. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. That's two diffused air horns. Ugh. Snap. Here, here, whoever's up there, just like roaming around. Fucking kill me. Jeez. <coughs> really? Fucking bullshit, man. Alright. We need to think. What would I possibly have? Do I have an inventory of anything? <sighs> These drawers weren't like that. Someone's been here while I've been out. Oh shit. That's a good point. Huh. Maybe there'll be something around here I didn't notice before that I can take. When I went through these books, they weren't on the floor before. Oh. That's it, really? And didn't this thing blow up on me last time? Yeah, are you dying or something? Uh, yeah, I felt like it for a second. Thanks for caring. <laughs> I can't pry the painting off the wall. Can't open anything there. Bro, how do I get up to you? Can't pick any of that up. Jesus. Why would you pry a painting off the wall as it hung up on one nail? It says I have to, like... It's stuck to the wall. I'll show you what the instructions said. I can't move it. It's firmly fixed on the wall. So it's not like it's hanging by a nail. There's actually something like holding it in place. Problem is I don't have any tools to like do anything with it. Oh, I could definitely turn both, but... I'm pretty sure I already did something with this one. I guess turn them away from each other or some. Sh oh, maybe towards each other. Cooley, you fucking genius. Genius, kid. The question is, is what the hell did that do? Did it unlock the trap door? No. Did it... Chill this thing out. Oh my god, it worked. The outside, May 14th, 1974, 56. Hmm. 
This is nice. Uh huh. I hope this place has Airbnbs. Sounds fantastic. I mean, I. Are you all Airbnb people? Or are you hotel people? Like, there's no judging either way, you know? I'm just, just out of curiosity. All that for team of the Backstreet Boys? Yo, I'd be lit if Backstreet Boys started playing. And I'd be like, shit, I need to mute the stream immediately. <laughs> like... And then, and then, and then the theme song hits. Yes, there's a lever here. Who turned on the Amazon lights over there? Who's playing the piano? Why is that door open all of a sudden? What happened there? The lights just went out? Like just behind you in the murk your ass. I think that way it would, may have been happening here. And I don't know if there's any aliens per se, but there's definitely a cult trying to get this alien cube back. Bro, what the fuck? Uh-huh. You couldn't get probed. Was that place really my father's secret hideout? It's difficult to believe, but everything suggests it was. I tried to bring as many things as I could with me to examine them here in my study. Many of his notes are written in a language that I don't know. However, this is his handwriting, I'm sure. Those, those bizarre photos did nothing more than lead me to ask more questions. Those landscapes are so surreal. What the hell are those huge structures in the distance? It looks like my father was doing research into an ancient artifact and his connection to some mysterious places populated by some sort of horrible beings. What does, this, what does all this mean? What was he really working on? In the shed, there were some strange statuettes and old cassettes, too. I brought them here to study them. <sighs> There's someone in the apartment. I clicked the mouse so fucking fast. Cover your fucking mouth, dude. Hold your breath? I don't know. Is it safe to come out? Bro, I don't know. Don't speak. I know just what you're saying. <clears throat> okay. 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 Okay, go to the journal. Oh, there's anything else in here I can really do. Chest. Chest here with a strange man because we need to force it with something. God damn. I don't think there's anything else in this room now, for sure. I just want to kill you a little bit. Nope, no one's home. <laughs> Yo. Is whatever was upstairs. Before I go up there, I need to check what's in this room. What was going on in here? I think it had to do with that mirror. Oh, yeah, it definitely did. Holy fuck. What happened here? The disgusting stuff seems to have come out of the mirror. Yo. That thing fucking trans... Like, it's a... Transported somebody. 
They came over here and started playing fucking piano. <laughs> Night demon. Stream sniping? What? <sighs> Great fucking timing there. What the fuck was that? Oh. <sighs> fucking prick. <sighs> My god. I, just, I thought it was a fucking body at first. I immediately just was like, there's a dead body here. Oh, shit. Oh, man. There's a lot more room up here than I thought. What the fuck? Yo, that's like someone whispered to me right on the edge of the way that light ended. Holy fuck. Yo, get me out of here right now. The strange contraption is the most mysterious object that I took from my father's secret hideout. What's its function? It seems that it allows the creation of a small magnetic field, but something's missing for sure. There's an ancient metal door near the hideout, but I wasn't able to open it. It may lead deep into the mountain, and what I need is probably right there. The whole area is full of tunnels and old galleries. People say that in those mountains, there's a huge web of underground passages that stretch for miles. Now that I think of it, the family cabin is not very far from that place. It's right at the top of that mountain. What if somehow everyone's connected by the tunnels? Are there more of them around there? First of all, I should go to the cabin and check it out. I'll leave early in the morning. Oh, cool. That looks like a completely normal cabin in the woods. What strange machinery? What if I place the cube here? Was that a good fucking idea? I don't know if that... I don't know if that's a good idea. Yo, this sucks. I think I'm done being in here. Let's see if I can maybe go get the cube or something. Oh, great timing on the follow. Holy shit, that scared me. Yo, so much extra. Welcome. Welcome to the mob. Um, we actually have a giveaway going on right now, which you kind of just entered in just by following. Um, if you would like to get a free Steam game... Hello, welcome. Uh, if you like a free Steam game, um, if you join the Discord, um, do exclamation point, uh, exclamation mark, Discord, um, and follow the link, uh, and then I will send you a free Steam game. Okay, I'm gonna go take the cube back. Oh, the whispering kills me. Come on, why are you so slow? Okay, so we need to go back up into the attic, into that room, dump this on the machine and run it and see what happens. Okay. Any reason why that just happened? Wahoohoo! Yo, Seeker270, welcome to the mob. Shh, fuck me. Uh, Seeker, if you're interested, um, I'm giving away free Steam games. Um, if you would like... Oh, you're on top of it. <laughs> you found it. So if you just want to join the Discord by doing exclamation point Discord, and then let me know when you're in there, and then I will hook you up with a free game as well. Alright. Who closed the fucking door on me? I can't go through here anymore? Damn it, I have to go through the glass. I, I jumped over it. Look at me, fucking big brain. Oh yeah, I have to pry that open, I forgot. I 
hate going up this ladder. Place cube here. Turn it on. That may have been a bad idea. No more locked doors. Was that the right thing to do? Oh, what? Oh, I fell. Oh, what the fuck? So that's how Batman died. Maybe. Holy shit. <laughs> yeah, let me know once you... Uh, Soma and Seeker, once you... Um, once you're in the Discord, just send me a message in chat that you're here. Am I still alive? Oh, I was just hallucinating? How is that possible? It's gone. What's happening to me? The cube's gone. Fuck. That's not good. You have arrived? Okay. Let me hook you up then. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. I see, uh, and I'm assuming Ark Survivor is Seeker. Um, if you both want to type in chat, a number between 1 and 16. Talk to the background music while we wait. <clears throat> Excuse me. Again, one, oh, 9. Okay, cool. Soma. Ah, I didn't know anything about this one. True grab bag. You got a telef Telefrag VR. Hope you enjoy. And again, welcome to the mob. I appreciate you. And uh, Seeker, if you are Ark Survivor in Discord, you can send a number between... Um, well, now it's 1 and 15. I screwed everything up. Yeah, and uh, hey, I understand you. it's a giveaway. You're here for a free game, probably. Um, would love if you hung around, or if you got things going on, it's cool, too. Hope you come back at some point. We're always here. Try to be. Ugh. Alright, so while Seeker is thinking about a number, I'm gonna head back over here and continue to scare the shit out of myself. I don't need a false sense of security of what I've been doing. I really want to go over there, but I feel like... Oh, now I can. It definitely sounded like something was here. It was super creepy. Ooh. What's this? A cassette. Look at that. Well, I'm sure I'm for sure. I see you come into the fish pit all the time. Oh! I fucking love that dude. He's awesome. And I appreciate you for jumping over. I won't tell him you were here. Don't worry. Oh, this is the new dog I'm uh, adopting. <laughs> My word. You know what would suck is if all of a sudden it, would, it stopped counting down the seconds left and the noise was still going on behind me. That'd be a bad time. Oof. What an amazing recording. Yes. We call that scary as fuck. Alright, cool. We're done being upstairs now. I don't think there's anything up here I want to play with anymore. In fact, I don't want to be in my dad's apartment anymore. Seems reminiscent of Eternal Darkness on the Cube. I don't think I played that. I see. They don't want me in this house anymore. They probably have the cube. 
Oh no. Whoa. What? What does this mean? Yo. This is totally normal. Hi, Steve. It's locked. Luckily for me, I don't like the sound coming from in there at all. Yeah, I can't tell if that's a skeleton or just overgrowth or something. What happened here? What's this place? Yo, this is so bad. It's so fucking bad. Hello? Hold, Steve. It was headed of its time for sure. It was a sanity meter that made weird things happen if it was filled too far. So much of gameplay it was pretty neat. Oh, it sounds a little bit like amnesia. Like, if you're in the dark too long, you start going insane and, like, envisioning shit. What am I examining here? My god, am I dreaming? I fucking hope so. Hopefully that's the phone that's waking me up. Oh, my god. Alright, don't fucking go near that thing. Nope. Mm -mm. I'm gonna try it. Not worth at all. Um, I don't know if I want to go to the basement quite yet. That sounds like a bad idea. They released Amnesia on V... Oh, probably the, the newest one. If it's the OG, that's fucking scary as shit. Mechanism, I don't have it. Fuck. Alright, I just have to go down to the basement. Yeah, I haven't played the new one yet. I heard it's a little bit of a step back, but it's a ni nice for, like, nostalgia purposes of, like, oh, shit, a new Amnesia game. I've played the first one, The Dark Descent, and it was very good. I haven't played um, Machine for Pigs yet, being the sequel, but I, I definitely will. Is this a fucking torture chamber? The one looks so good. Oh, well. Play it if you haven't, for sure. Outlast will always have a place in the book. Oh, Outlast? Yeah, Jesus. I've yet to finish the second one. I played it a bit um, on stream, like the first hour or so. And I jumped to something else. Strange shops is entering his body. Uh, yep. Um, I was doing a, like a long charity stream and I was just jumping from game to game. Uh, but I do want to go back to it at some point. What was that sound? Oh, I thought it was above me for a second. I almost shit myself. Oh, God, okay. It's just the drippies from the ceiling. Okay. 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 It's fine. Oh. Seems like I have to catch you playing that. Yeah, I'll definitely be playing it again at some point. And then, um, probably closer to when they announce, like, Outlast Trials, which is going to be the third game and actually has multiplayer. Yeah, I know what you mean. Like, sometimes I laugh at myself and I get scared because it's just, it's so fucking ridiculous. Can't fucking see over here. Can't see over there. Alright, doors locked. So many locked doors. Am I getting a puzzle room right now? 
Those machines are huge. Who could have built them? Fucking steampunk aliens. What's all this for? What if I try to stop these gears? That's a terrible idea. Let's do it. Jigsaw. Oh, God. No way a game called Alien Cube, Alien Cube is a puzzle room. Alright, they made a noise back here, deliberately. Apparently, scalps you while you try to solve the puzzle. Dude, fucking real. Iron bar. Voila. That just so conveniently fell from the ceiling. Alright, let's do it. This shouldn't be any problem. Oh god. I always heard that things explode in this game and you can die from it. Nope, oh, nothing different. Okay, so someone's gonna get mad and run out and kill me now. You thought something popped down on me? Yeah, no, just the, uh... <laughs> Alright, that was like a super lock on the door. What was the fucking point of that? I'm not, I'm not doing okay with this. see anything? Because I didn't. What do I... Does he drop down behind me or something? He was behind me. That means fucking run. I got it. Oh no! I almost ran right into that. Thank God it stopped. Thank God it fucking stopped. Oh God, what sort of creature is this? What were they doing to it? I have to take that lever. The lever for the door. We need the monster Vlad's dad. Deaths one. Very funny. Get the fuck out of here. Well, I gotta go this way. This looks interesting. Steps. Is that like scalding hot water? Uh. Yep, it is. Okay. Now I know. Uh. Fuck. That's not good. So a dead end just for a jump scare. Gotta love it. Remember when Visage did that to me, too? In the Lucy chapter, and I'm like, looking at the drawing on the wall, it's like, door this way, and I open the door, and there's a giant fucking demon head in front of me. That was bullshit. I was trying to be friends. Yo, is that the mirror? It's like if Mist and Elden Ring had an evil baby. That's... that's pretty fair. Yeah. Locked. Okay. Can I make that jump? I don't think I can. 
You know what? We're gonna fucking try it. No. Didn't work. <laughs> but it was a hell of an effort. So, there must be something I can either grab from around here. Or I have to go back into the little other room. Just back, back through the crawl space. This doesn't even do anything for me. Oh, so I hear the whispering, like as if the cube's nearby. Which is interesting in and of itself. Yeah, fucking zap the cube and look where it does to me. Yeah, go hide. Go, uh, go enjoy this, uh, lovely dimension where I'm from. Okay. No big deal. I think I'm supposed to jump down there. How do I stop the water? Right, so it's coming from this pipe here. Which I think is that one, even though it doesn't line up perfectly. Yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> Do much with it anyways. And this one goes this way. Can't do anything with that. Fuck. <gasps> Did it again? Jeez, I wasn't ready for it to copy it. Oh, what's this hook up here for? Can I grab that? Nope. Okay. Alright. Fuck it. I'm just gonna try it. Just to know. Just to know. Okay. That's fine. Now we know. Hey, wait a second. Can I... Oh. Okay. So it has to be... Oh, I can examine this. That's weird. The fire doesn't emit any heat. Huh. So interesting then. There's nothing around here at all. Can't grab that. Can I like, crawl underneath this or something? No. Can't jump over it. Door's still locked. I don't know what the alien looks like. That's the scary part, is like it's they won't even show us. Couldn't jump. Okay. Nothing up here. Just to confirm. Nothing in the corner. There's got to be something I'm missing somewhere. Like, I can't go this way. It won't let me. Checking the ceilings. Can't go that way. There's nothing really that way anyways. It's, it's all crumbled. I can't examine anything back here. Uh, hello? Slabs. Not helpful. I guess I'll check these flames again. No. No, can't do anything with them. I may need to fucking cheat and look this up. Also, can we get a third time? <laughs> yep. <laughs> it's good. Oh, you know, it's because the checkpoint. Can I just crouch under here? Nope. Okay, fuck. Sh shit. Can 
Can I dive roll? No. I'm gonna try to sprint through it, though. Yeah. Oh. Okay. I figured it'd be like an invisible wall type of thing where you can't go through it. Well, okay, now we know. Hello? <laughs> Is that a giant eyeball or a fucking asshole? What the fuck? There's a key somewhere? What the hell is possible? Where am I? Bro, I'm asking the same question. Is that James the Giant Peach's old house? What the fuck? Gonna watch Moon Knight? Oh, hey, enjoy it. Hope it's good. I've been looking and I'll eventually watch it. Just I'm so bad on other things. But thanks for stopping by as always. Alright, now that I have a key... Of course, it works on the door where the dude keeps walking by from right to left. Wait, he was up against the wall right here and then walked by? What is this madness? Okay. Just keep your wits about you. You work here. No one will know any different. The telephone's ringing for us, probably. Run for it. Let's quickly check this room, because I'm a whore. Nothing. I just wanted to know. Whew. Everything hurts in this game. Oh shit. Yo, is that... What's up with Cthulhu here? Bro. I don't need you in another fucking game. Ooh. Oh! Oh! He's so fast! What is he doing to my body? What am I supposed to do here? Do I, I have to run into that room, I bet, and close the door? I can't close it yet, though. The tickle monster. <laughs> Let me through. Okay, go anywhere. Yeah, that worked. He didn't follow me. <laughs> Your bae Susie, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the mob. Ah, so you know all about the giveaway too. I see. Well, do me a favor, make sure you join the Discord. Um, and let me know when you get there. I'm actually gonna check to see if anybody else is uh hopped in here. Oh, look at this. Oh, Boston, you hopped in here too. Appreciate you. Discord's a pretty solid place, just a bunch of bullshittery good community. Lots of people I respect a lot. But yeah, when you and, uh, and if Seeker's still here too, let me know. But, um... Cheers. Oh, yo! Curbs! Yo, hey, do me a favor. Um... Actually, I don't even care if you have Discord or not. You're good, you're good for it. Um... Do you have, uh, you have Steam. I will give you a free Steam key, sir, because you followed earlier today. Um, give me a number between 1 and 15. The alien looks like Zinyak? What the fuck? What shit are you smoking, bro? Alright, and while Curbs is giving me a number between 1 and 15, um, oh, 6, okay. Oh, you got Tooth and Tail. That game, my buddy Bird's been playing, and he says it's fucking outrageous. Um, okay, I'll hit you up over on, I got you on Facebook, I'll just send it over there. Blap. So yeah, you toss in your Steam thing and you're good to go. 
I don't know who Zinyak is. That's why I was like, what the fuck are you smoking? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> um, while we're at it, too, let's, uh, let's give away another, another one as well. Um, actually, you know what? Because it came up, let's give out the newest Amnesia game. Amnesia Rebirth. Whoever wants it, go grab it, toss it in your Steam. Saints Row 4 Antagonist. Oh, I haven't played any of the Saints Row yet. I've seen a little bit of gameplay. <laughs> I'm the man. No, you the man. Um, yeah, whoever gets Amnesia Rebirth, let me know. And I, I have not seen the newest one. Where did this fuck go? Um, there's a few game. There's a few games left. Um. If you could do me a favor, um, your bay, if you do uh, exclamation point Discord, or if anyone wants to for me, um, and just join the Discord, and then let me know when you're in there, and I'll take your number from you. For which Steam game you're going to get. Appreciate you. Shit. Is he coming back? Can I peek? No? He's not coming back. Okay. Um, he's probably just up there being a creeper. We're gonna go God mode like Cosmo streams. What do you mean, go god mode? That door's open now. Or was it always open? No, oh, it was always open, that's right. Oh, yeah, how do I get over there? The fuck? Oh, shit! Yo, some Indiana Jones shit. Get the fuck out of here. I made it. Oh, it's mod. Over. God, mod. <laughs> I think I'm good. Do I have it back for Blood Game Code? I do. That's the phone from the Vision to your right. Yeah, exactly. I knew what place this was. Um, this is the apartment we've been kind of dicking around. Is this one we have? Journal? What is this? Oh, the dungeon. Okay. What was that crazy place? Did I have another vision? No, but I've experienced cases would be my imagination. That place was real and I was really there. I'm sure. It's like I was living in the re reality, like I was trapped in an endless nightmare. The cube must be the cause of all this. What's it? What's its real purpose? Who made it? No, not so. <clears throat> uh. <laughs> oh, thanks, Boston. I appreciate you. So yeah, um, so you, your bay. If you, whenever you join the Discord, just let me know. Actually, I think I that might be you that joined. It is. <laughs> if you want to just do me a favor, then if uh, toss in the chat here a number between one and thirteen. Jesus! Oh, they can have the amnesia monster. Yeah, you can just toss the number right in here into the chat here. Um, where is my control of this? Oh, I need to get out. Okay. Cool. Um, now what do we do? Remember I thought the doors were all fucking boarded up? That was fucked. Seven. Davy Jones from that movie. <laughs> from that movie. So I just leave? I think I'm just going to leave. You ever hear the kids screaming? Leave. Yes, leave. Leave. I can't just leave. First I have to take the cube. I wonder if it's still up in the fucking machine. Seven is the lucky number. Yeah, I'll get it to you in one second. I thought it was the end of the mission, or level, or chapter. Whatever we're calling these partitions in the game. Can 
subscribe to find it at all costs, but how I said to go to the old camp where Edgar, Edgar disappeared, I might find more answers there. Okay, so I did go up here first and realize it wasn't here. Now I could probably go back and go. New set of armor plates for this alien? Yeah. I don't have nearly the stomach for these games. It's awesome to watch the holy shit things out if I try to play. Oh, dude, yeah, there was there was a couple of moments in this particular chapter where I was I shot backwards. It was fucked. <sighs> okay. Awesome. That is a loading point. Chapter five, the gas station. Let's go get this game over. <laughs> Necro worm. I think I recall that goofiness in a trailer. But uh, your bay, I just sent you over. Um, nice could not be delivered. It's usually because you don't share a server with the person receiving the recipient. Well, all right. It's not letting me DM you, actually. That's strange. Oh, I, it says that you're, um, oh, I thought you were in the, uh, the Discord. Hold the phone. What is going on here? That's weird. All right, it's not letting me DM you. Um, Pro see your witness. <laughs> Let me do you a favor then, because for some reason I can't. Yeah, I'm not able to DM you for some reason. So instead of busting the code out right in there in the chat, um, let me see if I can whisper you yeah, on Twitch. Night, bitch. Oh, well, thank you, Anonymous Cherry, for the one bit. I appreciate you. You can do what you think. Oh, okay. Well, I'll send it to you then. Okay, I'll accept you as a friend. I get it. Now it'll probably work. There we go. Okay. No, I, I so she's, uh, your base sent me a friend request on Discord. That way I could actually send it that way. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. I can't get that place out of my head. What I saw has been in my head the whole way. Edgar's cabin must be somewhere among these mountains. I didn't imagine it was this high up. There's a lot of snow here and it's freezing outside. There should be a gas station just ahead, but a fallen tree is blocking the road. I'll have to leave the car here and continue on foot. Because of fucking course. Alright, oh, great. Yo, my ride. It's all covered in frost. Hey, Granny Fred, I have to leave the car here. You driving that thing in the snow? Fucking doubt it. <sighs> Don't forget my flare. I was expecting it to go out. That's why I was staring at it. Yo, look at the fucking sky. That green hue is so creepy. Let's just run. Who needs fucking stamina? Okay, just a wolf. No big deal. Step on light and see if you really... <laughs> Rick <Ric> Flair. <laughs> I made it to the gas station. Hello! This, that must be Edgar's car. It's been here the whole time? There's a locked trunk back here. Oh, they left the cube at the... Fucking bastard. Green sky is usually a tornado. That's not good. Okay, so that was the cube and it just fucking disappeared on me. September 13th, 1999. Strange sightings in Black Hill. A truck driver who has passed through Black Hill gas station claims to have seen strange lights in the sky on the night of August 5th, the same night that Jean Merton, 34, the mother of two girls, disappeared. His account coincides with those of other local people, including Shirley Harrison, who told us, quote, I saw a big flash in the sky that night. It was about 2.15 a.m., unquote. Mrs. Harrison added that she heard a horrific cry coming from the forest an hour later. Or a horror game, or a lich. <laughs> this is true.
Uh, you guys open? No. I got the one lights on. You know what? I'm gonna fall for it. Let's do it. Let's pump the gas. No? Okay. Cool. Check the shed. No. <laughs> Run. Wait, wait for it. Wait for it. Run. Alright, so that was a, a kind of pointless, but the good news is that it looks like it set us off a path to go get to the cabin. I think that's the point. Save game. There we go. We'll go check the well really quick. Was that a moan I heard coming from down there? Not the type of moan you hear on Skinamax at this hour, that's for sure. Oh, it's the fucking rope. I'm like, I just heard a footstep. Oh, it's horrible. What were they doing here? Dude, really? Are we asking those types of questions right now that we will not get the answers to, but we are going to find out soon? What the fuck was that? I'm sorry, what? What's up with the big fucking crater here? Good god. Whew. Alright. Back to it. Let's get up these uh, little hay bales and into the uh, loft of this house. Oh yeah, another attic. Fantastic. Page. <clears throat> Get scalped again. Stop it. Journal of a member of the Order. We managed to successfully divert the attention of the press. The Mitchell case risks becoming a big problem for all of us. From now on, we'll pay more attention. We fenced the whole area so it will be easier to defend it. Our men and the police will handle problems and ensure that no one asks questions anymore. The great priestess appreciated our engagement, and once again, her directions were essential. She's the mother of all of us, and her wisdom was guided, has guided us for generations. As a reward, I and a few others will be privileged to undergo the first transformation stage. I'm sorry, what? In this way, we'll become stronger, and our bodies will age much more slowly. However, we'll have to isolate ourselves from society and spend the coming days in our shelters as we wait for the day of revelation. Just drink the Kool-Aid. This is some John Travolta Scientology shit. <laughs> what in the world? Alright, let's head down and in, I guess. <clears throat> what the fuck? Fuck. Yo, E.T., you want some Reese's Pieces, man? I got his dad. It can't have been lit long since he was killed. The blood is still fresh. Well, I got some shears, so... Hello? I know Kung Fu! God. But I'll try to skip if he wants a sandwich. What the fuck? Wait a minute. How? The only door is through the attic? There's no other door here. Oh, it's right here, right. But I can't open it because the fucking haze in the way. Let's see if I can go back up here. Oh, no, maybe not. No, okay. 
All right, cool. Let's backtrack a bit then. I think there's another path back here we can take. Also, how do I get up there? That looks fun. Is it going to let me go up here? No, it's probably not going to. Oh, there's a hole in the fence back here. You'd think there'd be an option to. Huh. Oh, what's this? I can't even fucking read that. Nice. Okay. This is what we needed it for. Let's go. In Edgar's car, there's a trunk. I try to open it before I go on. Oh. Okay. Fine. Can I use this, the shears on it, too? Yep. Let's go. Better be a fucking AK. Nope. It's a page in the journal. The whole area around the gas station has been fenced, blocking the shortest route. That's not a problem. I'll go on foot from here. Then I'll spend a couple days in the cabin. If my theory about the tunnels is right, I should be able to find more of them around here, maybe near the cabin, too. <clears throat> Excuse me. My father often mentioned in his notes that he had to come here as if he had to meet someone. Did he and other members of the Order meet somewhere here in the woods? Did they use those old tunnels? It seems the Order has existed for thousands of years with only the most ancient families participating in the gatherings. Lovely. That whole thing... Just to get a page from the journal. That was what's locked up. Fine. Let's go... Give me a fucking shotgun. God damn it, Edgar could have put that in the glove box. Well, he likes to keep... So Edgar is my character's dad. And he was studying up on the cube and everything. And like... This order. Um, so he kept all of his work hidden from his wife and me. And it only took until he died. Like I got like his... In his last will and testament basically said like oh yeah like you're here take all of my work and they, like you have to finish it so here we are in the middle of fucking nowhere at this cabin in the middle of a blizzard being hunted down by cultists and aliens oh and hey don't forget pretty sure one of them has to do with Cthulhu and why can't I go up there What the fuck, dude? He goes, son, here's all my work. The world is about to end. Good luck. <laughs> For real. No, don't throw those tentacles at me. Away, Fry. I thought I was supposed to go up to that cabin. I guess that's not the cabin, then. This has lots of, uh... Resident Evil 8 Village. Bro, what? That is the most fucked up snowman I think I've ever seen in my life. It's fucking terrifying. <laughs> Soma, what is that? Olaf. More like, oh no. I hear the whispering, the cube is near. We're here. Someone's here. There's a fucking fire. Bro, what the fuck? What the fuck? Oh no. What happened? I've had a horrible vision here. Dude, we're back in this place again. Oh, maybe not. Oh, I thought it was a shadow of someone walking by. It's a tree. What did I just pick up? Oh, a shovel. Oh god. 
Something big is walking around. It's terrible. Get back in the house. What the fuck? Yo, what? Was... Oh my god. Was that a windigo? It can't be. Was that seriously like a fucking windigo or something? Light switch rave. Just stuck like. <laughs> this thing is giving off an unbearable smell. Gross. So that's it. I couldn't even go upstairs here. Yeah, there's no staircase. Let's check back around. There's another door. Yeah. See, I know what's up. And never mind. I don't know what's up. Clearly. A little igloo for the kids. <laughs> Alright, so uh, I guess we'll keep going. Or not. Snowdrift. Oh, I'm shoveling the snow drift. I'm gonna be tired as fuck after moving all that snow. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Alright, not all of it, just enough to climb over. Save point, looking good. I'm pretty sure that's a fucking giant windigo. Which sucks because that's like folklore that's outside of like alien stuff. So to have to have aliens and folklore? Get out of here. What's this? Oh, this is the... Oh. Gentlemen, remember the order. We have sighted the creature once again. The same day Edgar disappeared, we saw it for the first time. It is a magnificent specimen that is evolving very fast. Its growth is outstanding and soon will reveal its final shape. The sacred tomes tell of similar creatures sent by the ancient gods to punish the people. I'm sorry, you went... Oh, Jesus. I'm not going to try to cross that yet. Let me go in this place first. Oh, it's time, baby. Yo, Twisted. That's just... That screams no. And only... <laughs> yeah. I'm not going to say it. Nope. Boom. Where is it? Oh, wait, wait. Wait. No. oh shit. <laughs> Yo, I loved that game. And hated it at the same time. What's up, everybody? Welcome in. Uh, Twisted, appreciate the raid, my friend. Thank you so much. Let's give him a thug life. And, um, even though I, Rage is here, Maggers is here, I know all you fine people. If anyone new here for the first time, maybe not in a while, uh, we're doing a giveaway. Um, I'm going to give you a free Steam Keys. Whether you either um, talk to me 500 bits, or you gift a sub, or sub yourself, or you follow because you haven't followed yet, and join the Discord. Pretty simple. Thanks, Boston. Appreciate you. Um, and just as a welcome for everybody here, I hate when the music cuts out like that. Um, let's give away a game. Let's give away a game. That looks, uh, fucking bullshit! I don't think it's fucking bullshit at all, Diz. But thank you for the bits. Uh, so hopefully for those who are not on mobile and have the ability ability to uh, copy paste, um, I'm dropping in right now a Steam key for free for anybody in the chat. Uh, Warhammer Forty Thousand Dawn of War. All yours, whoever wants it. Go grab it, toss it in Steam. Once you redeem it, just tell me you have. Yo, Star, what's up? Welcome. Okay, I've done that, I've done that, I've done that. Okay, cool. I've pulled everything out. We're good to continue again. Um, so we're playing the Alien Cube. And I can't go that way. Great. Um, and we just saw some big fucking thing walk by. It had some... Uh, antlers? Take it. Just take it. 
Free game's a free game. You know what I'm saying? Jump. Oh my god. <laughs> he did not jump. I can't wait to get a new rig up so I can play my Steam. Set my Steam up and going again. Nice. Oh wait, so am I you a streamer? This is uh, not feeling good at all. That Still got that green light going on up there. Still very low visibility. He walked right through here. Look at all the fucking down trees. Holy shit. Where is it? I'm looking for it, but I don't see it. Hello? This is bad. This is fucking bad. That bridge is gonna get fucking taken out. Let me go wide. See what's over this way. Or it's gonna drop off. God damn it. Okay. Going through the bridge we do. <laughs> bridge we do. Did you redo? Oh, I've got fucking shivers expecting this thing to just fucking come trampling out. Bro, it's me. Oh, let's get some hypothermia. <laughs> wow, okay. Cool. Well, someone took it, I tried to redeem it. Ah, A for effort. Uh, fucking bullshit! <laughs> good time and twisted. Thank you for the bits. <laughs> oh, we got a journal entry. The creature of the woods. That terrifying creature. No, it can't be real. It's not possible. <laughs> I can't tell visions of reality apart. My mind is falling apart. I feel I'm losing control. But I can't give up now. The call is getting stronger. The cube must be nearby. This whole area seems to be under the Order's control. It looks like Edgar's cabin is in the heart of their territory. It seems that he knew nothing of this, but how is it possible that he didn't know? Yo, butt cheek! One Corgo, one Corgo, one Corgo, one Corgo, one Corgo, one Corgo. <laughs> Thank you, I appreciate you. Um, my God, I didn't do enough this, but uh, yeah, clearly this Hello guy there. was just <laughs> Hello, Soma. Uh, clearly this guy was like Edgar, the father, was part of the order. The cabin belonged to Grandfather William. Oh, and William was part of it, too. Was there another secret location where he used to meet the other members of the Order? I have to reach that place, but I have to be very careful. They know I'm here. I mean, they definitely know you're here, because... I mean, hello. <laughs> Jesus, twisted. Alright, this is not a cabin. This is a fucking altar. There's a corpse right there. Or skeleton, I should say. A few skeletons. This is nice. Let's read the page. Prisoner's notes. They came back. Juan and I had been taken and carried out to the heart of the forest. They tied us up and blindfolded us so we couldn't see what was happening, but we could hear everything. I could still hear those terrible chants. They had never spoken before at that moment, but when I heard those cries, oh god. It's like they went away and left us alone, but something huge approached and took Juan shortly after. I'll never forget his agonized screams. Luckily, I managed to free myself and run away, but what I've seen, I don't even want to think about what would happen to me if I, if I stayed there. This abandoned church is the only shelter i found. There are skeletons everywhere, and everything is covered by a viscous substance, but it's still better than staying out there. I'll spend the night here, and I'll try to go back to the car. I'm sure you will. Oh, I appreciate you, boss. Have a great night, dude. Thanks for dropping by and chilling. Right, this music is getting fucking intense. Alright, calm the fuck down here. Oh, look at that. Someone else drew the picture, too. Oh, my God. I can't grab the book. Oh. I thought I was going to read the book. I got very excited. This, yeah, this can't be the fucking cabin. This just had to be a little short stop here. Let me go check the well. Nope, can't use it for anything. Oh, because it's fucking plugged up with trash. Trash! Check around back. Ah! 
Howard Dean up in this bitch. By the way, um, there's plenty of follower emotes, so if you follow, you get emotes uh, just by following. And I think Howard Dean is one of them, if I do so recall. So now we're in a graveyard. I see nothing of importance except for corpses. Well, buried corpses, that is. Okay, I made it through. I'll try this way. So Jesus fucking Christ. Fry. Thank you for the biddies. <sighs> Holy shit. Oof. Okay. Um, this isn't good. I may have to cross... I may have to wade through the water. And it's freezing. Literally and figuratively. Okay. Uh, fuck. Alright, yeah, I think I have to wade through the water over here. It's my only option. Without backtracking. <laughs> yeah, hardy har har har. Alright, ready? Let's go for it. Uh. Oh, it let me. Okay, cool. Wait, is the water not as cold here? Confused? Hmm. Well, there's the bridge again. Or is this a different bridge? No, it's the same fucking bridge. What the hell? I did a big circle. God damn it. There's gotta be something else that I've missed. The question is what? Because there's the church. Yo. Oh, can't go through that way. Fine. Let me just double check the uh, the chapel out here. Make sure I didn't miss anything. Nothing on the roof, right? No. One page. Nothing in that pew. Nothing in that pew. Nothing here. You know, there's nothing here. Map button. I need a map. Where am I going? See, again, this is... Huh. So that's the graveyard. Follow the left wall. I kind of did. Or what do you mean before I get to the uh, the chapel? That is, I guess that's what you could have meant. I'll try that out. Ba -ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da. We'll just zim on through the graveyard, stepping on everybody's graves, pissing everybody off, and thank you. Oh, well, good point, and you were correct. And that must be the cabin down there. Let's get the fuck out of this wilderness, get some warm, some hot cocoa. Take a nice little nap. Oh, never mind. This is not a cabin. This is a fucking dungeon. Oh, darn, it's locked. Mm, I guess we'll just have to come back later. The red light behind the door. The fuck is that shit? Just run. I'm not turning around. You can hardly see. Oh god! Run. God, please run. Run. Follow. The, the lights. Oh god. 
Oh god. I hope I'm going the right way. Oh fuck me. Oh god. Oh god. Oh. That is a murder shed. <laughs> I just know she's the 0451. <laughs> Eventually, I am going to find a combination in a game or a passcode in the game of the 0451. Because at one point in a game, we found that and it never got used for anything. Where the fuck am I? Wait, what was that? Oh, nothing. Yuck is. Alright. Now where the fuck are we? Candles. How nice. Oh, a cave system. This should work well. What the fuck? <laughs> Are you serious? I just got jump scared by that? Yeah. Great. Great. Awesome. <laughs> it, it honestly butts you. It was a great time with Benny Hill. That was an entire scene, just me running away from that giant fucking thing. And thank you for the bits, uh, Jug Senior. We're playing Alien Cube today. Oh, I made it out. No, nah, white light. On to chapter six. All right, last chapter. Well, for tonight. The cabin should be nearby, but I can't find it. I think I'm lost. The temperature is dropping quickly. The wind is getting stronger. I should have come here. I have to find a way to warm up or it'll be the end of me. For real? I heard that song recently had to do it. <laughs> I mean, it was still a good... It was a good point there for the memes. Oh, he's here. Jokes here, not Vlad's dad. <laughs> <laughs> Although Vlad's dad is pretty cool. Oh, Soma, thank you for the sub. I appreciate you. It's very nice of you. Um... Let me get you another game really quick. If you want to toss... Yeah, toss me a number between 1 and 11. There's technically only four of these left. Because in the other seven we just drop into chat. Which I'll drop another one in here too. In fact... Here's Orbital Racer. Somebody grab it. I won't have a Steam set up for a bit. Do they expire? Nope. I've had some of these for nine years. Yeah, and whoever's quickest, uh, go ahead and grab that Steam key for Orbital Racer and redeem it into into your Steam account. And uh, just let me know if you've uh, if you used it and it worked. And yeah, so I mean, you can just give me a number between one and ten, and I'll drop you a, um, I'll drop you yours over DM. Lucky number seven again, huh? You've got Moon Hunters. Send it over to you now. Okay. Cool, cool. Back over here. In game. Let's do it. I need to kiss fucking fire. Oh my god, yeah, I did get bad. Alright, if we're cold, let's just keep running. Keep the blood flowing. That works, right? Ah, uh, that's not shelter. I'm freezing. I need to find shelter as soon as possible. This is the door. This is another door. I remember seeing a picture of this. It's shut tight since we locked from the inside. God damn it. Everyone locks their doors around here. What kind of fucking neighborhood is this? 
Uh, another cabin. Let's check it out. Let me guess. Locked. That's not a door. Windows. Fire. Fire recently went out. Fire went out off the stoke with more wood if I want to get warm. Okay, easy. Just go inside for fuck's sakes. Where's the Where's the door? Who builds a fucking cabin without a door? Do you climb through the windows? What? In the <laughs> fuck me. God, you love that gunshot. There's a branch. Perhaps perfect I have to find more of them. What is it? Seven days to die? Guess I'll just fucking run like this. Oh, another stick. Stick! Stick, stupid! Eh, no wonder you're extinct. I'm gonna run you over when I come back down here. And another one. But a couple of them should be enough. So two. A couple is two. Oh, alright, alright, alright. Relax, relax. Guys, like, I've never been in the cold before. Oh, another one. I need more wood. I should have to warm up with these. Ah, oh, my feet are freezing to death. All right, hold on, hold on. We're okay. We're gonna make it. Oh, yeah. Yellow. Thank you for the 500 bits, and we're off on another fucking hype train being close? Holy shit. And I'm glad Moon Knight's been good for you, Satan. <laughs> Diet rump die. <laughs> Some bleed German meat thing. <laughs> oh my god. How was that noise? How was it coming from inside the house? Doesn't make any fucking sense. Another, there's no doors. How do you get in? You can't. Warm it up. This is stupid. Slept all day, can't sleep. Oh, that sucks. Are you starting to feel any better? God damn it, the jump is so delayed too. All right, twisted. Thank you for the bits. Your mom doesn't have a door, plenty of guys. Oh my God. What the fuck? Why am I bleeding? Oh, it's this spot again. What's up with the fucking music? Just let me in. Does this mean I'm freezing to death again? I guess I had some ideas. I might... Oh, that's... If you're starting to feel better, then that's good. Hole in the roof? See, that's what I was thinking. But I can't get up there to even look. <laughs> All right, all right, warm up, warm up. I'm here. There we go. Okay. Okay. Cause I can't, can't do anything about that. I can't open any of these windows. <laughs> all this, all this wood. Jump from the half roof onto the back. Yeah, I can't get up here. It won't let me. The jump is very minimal in this game. See? It's just invisible walling me. I'm not too sure of where I'm supposed to go. Like, it sounded like it came from inside, but there's no way to get inside. This is some wacko trap door somewhere. 
which also might be a thing. I'll just run as far as I can in this one direction until I see that. Okay. Never mind. There's got to be something else out here. No, well, again. Just a sheer drop. Fuck. Alright, easy. Nope, not that way. I think I'm going to end up looping around here. I got to head back to the boat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks for the reminder. Alright, we'll have to get back to the fire. It's getting awfully cold. Oh, a deer's dead. Fucking frozen. Damn frozen venison. Alright, we're almost there, bud. Damn goosebumps just sitting here trying to get warm. Ugh. Ay, ay, ay. Goodness. Just, I'm just not. Fu Where the fuck did that come from? Can I fucking get up here? Oh, <coughs> Jesus fuck. Alright, I've already been here. Good God. Wait, the door's open. The door was open before. Thank you for the biddies. Good God. What does this do? What have I done? I don't want to be here. Ooh. Lookout's journal. Edgar's heading to the cabin again. We've warned everyone. We're gonna hide and watch him. We can't allow him to find out anything. Wow. So our dad made it here. And there were people here. They saw him coming and they just hid. It's fucking wild. I just killed my wind streak in Wordle. No! It's a sad day. F in the chat. Pay your respects. Jesus fuck, I just fell. <laughs> Fucking Christ. Am I supposed to be looking out here somewhere? Like, what's the point of coming all the way up here? Oh, seeing the giant bridge. That would probably do it. Otherwise, there's really nothing up here. It's very bland and boring. Alright, let's head out and go head towards that bridge. Maybe I can get there now. It was gonna be 69 too, of course it was gonna be. Yo, Anna Banana 154, welcome to the mob. Hey, just in case, if you're interested, and you want a free Steam key, oh the that's how I opened the door. Um if you join the Discord, thank you, Fry. <laughs> Not nice. Um, if you just join that Discord. Oh my god. If you just join the. There was a hole in the bridge. Um, as I was saying, if you join the Discord, let me know in chat when you do. And then um, I'm going to end up asking you for a number. Nerdle was easy today. I got pretty good at Nerdle. That's the math one. I know that wasn't you. That was Twisted. Alright, jump. There we go. Alright, made it across the bridge. What's going on over here? Gordy is the hockey one that rules. Satan, why are you now just telling me this? Did 
Is the storm stopping? What's up with the symbols? Ah! Jesus Christ. <laughs> Come on, Twisted. Leave me alone. <laughs> Thank you for the bits. Um, what the hell was I going to say? Gordy's on stand by me. <laughs> Correct. I uh, hit a saving point. Another bridge. But I'm freezing. Bro, Bromaxid. Bromaxid? Let me know if I pronounced that incorrectly. Apologies if I did. Welcome to the mob. Uh, we're doing a Steam giveaway. Uh, since you followed, all you have to do is just jump on Discord. And uh, I'll be able to DM you a Steam key. Oh, have a good night, Tree. I appreciate you, buddy. Thanks for coming through and hanging game looks good. The, the game's been pretty good, but this has been a, kind of a strange part of the game. Like, the whole game's been really fucking strange, but this has been, like, exceptionally strange, because I can't figure out where to fucking go. And now I'm freezing to death. I can't run anymore. Like, where's the fire at? Yep, yeah, I'm freezing to death. I'm dead. <laughs> Jesus. I'm sorry, Twisted. You what? Okay, so here's the fire. So it's the run over. At the first sign of ouchie ouchies, I turn around and come back. Question is, where the fuck do I go? Can't go down that way. Always follow the left wall. I need to listen to you more. <laughs> Is that a trumpet? I'm what? God damn it. Just keep following that left wall. Yeah, fuck indeed, it's cold. Where the fuck? Don't go out there, dude. Yo, Stroop, thank you for the host, my friend. Oh, sweet, on fire. Yo, Twisted, thank you for the raid earlier. Thanks for chilling, man. Thanks for the bits. Appreciate you a ton. Of the demon Babingtons. <laughs> Yeah, it's going, man. Just uh, playing some Alien Cube at the moment. Did I just do a fucking circle? No, I didn't. Um, this game is absolutely fucking wild. To say the least. Basically, we play a guy. Our dad just died. Oh, thanks, bro. I'll get you in a second. Um, our dad died, and he left all of his like life's work to us. And It's about how he was following some cult that may or may not have been in ties with aliens oh shit that fucking big thing's back again oh no at least the sun's coming up it's not gonna be so fucking cold anymore bro where where are we going we're going all the way down the mountain Finally, a cabin. It's not exactly like in the right area. It should be somewhere in the valley down here. Bro, can I just go in for a second? Thank Christ. Okay, we're going to heat up at the fire. And I, oh bro, a game coat. So bro, if you could do me a favor... In the chat here, right in the uh, in Twitch, give me a number between one and nine.
And while we're at it, while uh, Bro gives us number between one and nine, I'm actually gonna, I have one ready to go. I just wanna see what number he gives us. And if it's not the number I have selected, I'm gonna throw one in. You say nine, okay. I'm throwing number seven in here then. So everyone in the chat, go get Draw Slasher. Grab that up, throw it in your Steam account, and then if you got it, let me know. As for you, bro, my bro Max, I am sending you RPG Maker VX. Enjoy that. All right, we have still have five more. Uh, <laughs> how do I say it? Donated Steam keys. That should have gone to somebody that, that said, nope, just get rid of them. I don't want them. Um, so, yeah. Making our way through that list. There's only a few left. Let's read this page. That is an orb in the middle of the fucking woods next to a cabin. I know this place has a cabin, but what's that thing? Oh, it's a giant marble. Duh. Holy shit. Edgar's disappearance. We're watching Edgar's movements when he suddenly disappeared. We examined the photo that we were able to take... We noticed a big spherical object that was standing in front of the cabin. It dissolved shortly after, burning the surrounding area. We did our best to put out the fire, which almost completely destroyed the cabin. We have no idea what that thing was, and since then we haven't seen Edgar anymore. Yo, what the fuck? Orbeez? <laughs> That's an awfully strange emote to randomly have, but well played. Alright, so I have to head further down. This rope is completely frozen. Can I fucking kick it? Fuck. Alright, I gotta find something to probably cut it with. Uh, an axe? Nope. Scissors. Okay. That's fair, I guess. Let's just hit the fire one more time. Warm it up. Can I make a torch with a stick? I don't think so. Oh, good night, Jug Senior. Thanks for dropping by. Hope you get some sleep and, and feel right as rain tomorrow. There we go. Keep on heading down into this valley. This valley that just keeps getting... What? Oh, it's going to be the cube. We must be getting close to the cube. They must be trying to do something. Okay. You found the Darude party. No, the, those have to be blue lights. <laughs> Fantastic reference, though. Oh, I don't like this. Jump. I don't like this one fucking bit. And what did I do? Ran out right into the middle of it. Like an absolute fucking stooge. I need to find fire in Pronto. My ass gonna freeze to death. There's no reason to go this way. Oh, so I just died. Okay, or not. Oh, I see. It put me right in the way of the cabin. Thank you. Here it is, Edgar's cabin. Too bad there's no fucking fire. They already put it out. Page. Page for Edgar's journal. Blue lights and lots of sand. I wonder if you'll go back to where you started the game. That'd be interesting. What was that? That spherical thing. It seemed like something otherworldly, not man-made. As soon as I touched it, I saw a bright white light. The world around me began to warp and bend it on itself. I felt fear, an indescribable fear like I've ever felt before, when, for a moment, it felt as though I were leaving my body. The terror was so strong, my senses abandoned me. When I opened my eyes, I couldn't believe what I was seeing. I was in a place I'd never been before, trapped in a cage. Fortunately, I managed to escape, but what happened? Where am I? I don't recognize this place. I need to find help. So he probably ended up in the dungeon, just like we did. Because that shit sucked. Examine what? I wonder what happened to Edgar. The fire has destroyed everything. There's light coming from down here. Is there someone here? First, I can't open it with bare hands. For fuck's sakes. 
there anything else that was in here? So what did that say? Page and then... Oh, no, it's because it was down. Okay, I see. Fuck. Hopefully there's something outside. Stop touching things, Edgar. For real, my dad was a dummy. In-game, that is. Alright, there's nothing here, and I see that there's something up ahead. Good fucking god. Fuck. I'm walking so fucking slow. I can't move. Jesus. What the fuck happened here? What did that to him? It's a good question. Jesus. I oh, can't touch that. I got a save game spot, so I feel like I'm doing the right thing. Kind of. Elevator? Not open. Can't do anything there. Alright, we head downstairs. Oh, it sucks. <laughs> Bonked my head off the ceiling. So that's how they uh, make it so you can't jump to things you're not supposed to. They put little beams in the way so you can't jump. That's okay. We'll do it the right way and use the ladder. If I can just use the... If I could, if I could just use the... If I, if I could just... If I could just use the ladder. The, the ladder. The la the ladder. The ladder? Uh reset. <laughs> what the fuck? It like it said use and then immediately went away. And then nothing happened. So I feel like it just glitched. What the fuck? Well, that's a fucking problem. Why? I wonder if I hit some weird game-breaking glitch. Because I can't jump over it, because there's an invisible wall of some sort. Can't go there because the beam's in the way, and I'm not going to be able to make that jump anyways. Or if I just fucking sprinted at it. Oh! No! It didn't jump. There's like a delay on the space bar hit in this game for some reason. Check one more time. No? Okay, fuck you then. Yes. Yes. All that for a page of Cthulhu? I don't even know what the fuck that's supposed to be. That whole thing just to get a fucking page. Like, great, so I get an achievement or some shit, but... <laughs> God. Well, okay. Now what? Well, this isn't good. Fry, what did I tell you about the tentacles? This sucks. This is not how I wanted to play this. I think all of a sudden, oh, I had to crouch. 
Well, that's awfully silly. Choices, fucking choices. I don't like this one fucking bit. I have seen enough alien to know when something's wrong. I'm assuming that door. Oh, right. I'm assuming that door is probably locked. Good Christ. Journal of a member of the Order. Many of our past discoveries from the outside were lost. However, we must be eternally grateful to the Order and to the priestess for the secrets that they passed on to us and that we are all are keeping. Unfortunately, the God's Eye was lost by our ancestors. If we could get it back, all our questions would be answered. Ah, the alien cube is the God's Eye. And I brought it back to them. Hammer. An old bed, what's it doing here? Uh, I don't know, some, for someone to sleep on, probably, perhaps? I uh, can't use the hammer on the door. So let's go back, then. The gods, uh, didn't we make those in summer camp with the popsicle sticks and yarn? <laughs> Yo, good reference. <laughs> My summer camp was really big on GIMP, if you remember those. Like the, like, plasticky yarn shit. Fuck, what's over there? I can just make out some candles. I noted there was such a huge facility down here. How do I use the fucking hammer? Or, what do I use the hammer for? I don't think there's anything else over there. We've got the spiral staircase, cobra, and box dish designs. Yeah, you know what's up. <laughs> you know it. Can't use it here. Do I use it on this grate and just fucking dive in? Nope. Like how there's a dumpster in this dude's room. Let's use the hammer on the propane. Oops. Shit. Alright. Can't do anything with that door. Can't pick up anything else. So this room's clear. Clear the other spot. I guess I have to go back upstairs. But the question is, what the hell do I do upstairs with the hammer? Alright. Up we go. Help me use this hammer. Oh, thank you for being here, Fry, as always. You're the best. I appreciate you so much. Um, have a lovely, lovely night's sleep. I won't be too far behind at this rate. Now that it's uh, 1238. Hammer? Hammer? Nope. Hammer? Nope. Just examining it. Hammer? Nope. Hammer? Nope. Nope. Oh, the door's open. That's appreciate. Oh, you know what? Yeah. Right there. Somehow a hammer could open up a trap door because it's frozen, so. Let's check it out. into the trap door under my father's and grandfather's cabin. And it just collapsed. Ah! Good timing. <laughs> and apparently I broke the hammer or I don't want to use it anymore. It would have been a great defensive mechanism to have, but no, it's fine really. What is this place? Did Uncle Edgar know? Oh, I'm sorry. It was my uncle that died. It wasn't my father. Door. What in the fuck? They have one of these here too? Journal of Member of the Order. Let me begin when the God's Eye fell to Earth. Remember it as the event. The Great Priestess was chosen by the gods to witness it firsthand. Since then, all of her children re-experienced that moment in their dreams when they were ready to be called. Uh-oh. 
On the day of the event, however, the god's eye wasn't the only thing to arrive. Oh, shit. This place looks so familiar. Where have I seen that lake before? Bro, it's my calling. That's why I had the dream at the start of the thing. Oh, God, why is there a corpse here? You're really confused about a corpse at this point? Anywhere in this game, buddy? Okay, let's be a little more concerned about this. What the hell are these things? What is this place? Um... I have no fucking idea. That was me. Let's check over here first. Another corpse. It's still warm. Oh god, hopefully it's still a corpse and not something else. Prisoner's notes. I'm writing this report in case I don't survive. Mary, Brad, and I were going to Rock Valley when we stopped an old gas station. Suddenly some hooded guys came out of the forest and caught us. Everything happened so fast we couldn't even see their faces because they were wearing horrible reptilian masks. They have blindfolded and locked us in what seems to be a big underground facility. I can't tell where we are, but there's definitely a lot of water and some big machines in operation. They kept us in here for days in separate cells, but say something happened to Brad. He must have seen something terrible. He was out of control and ranting about monstrous beings, unspeakable abominations, and the world. Then they must have taken him as we have neither neither seen nor heard him anymore. Holy fuck. Yo. <laughs> That scared the ever-living shit out of me. Bruh. Can we not? Why is this music on? I don't like this. I don't have a weapon. That door opened. Okay. Yeah. This is the door that was there. Can I open it from this side? No. Okay. So only one way to go from here. Oh my god, I have to swim it, don't I? Oh no. This is bad. Reptilian overlords. Ugh. The secret facility. What else is this place hiding? I had no idea there was such a huge facility under the cabin. But what is it for? I can't believe Grandfather William was involved in all this. And what happened to Edgar? What I saw in that photo was bizarre. There was a strange object in front of the cabin the day of his disappearance. I don't, what I, have, um, I don't know where I'm finding the strength and the courage to proceed. This place is testing my sanity. I'm lucky I haven't been caught so far. I'm sure I'm not the only one here. <coughs> Definitely not the only one here, sir. We know that for a fact because we keep hearing people. Gross. What is... What? Yo, barnacles. I'm sorry. The fuck? My mind. Oh, okay. I'm like, did I get attacked? What was that? I can't go any further that way. It must have swam through. Let's keep going this way then. Oh, it's quite the uh, current here. Wait a second. What's this? Another door with blood? In the fuck? Can't do anything here. What about this? Bow. I don't know what I just did. But it sounds like I broke something. Or I opened some doors. scared the fuck out of me. No, not that way. Huh. Well, 
wonder what I was turning those valves for then. Weird. There has to be a reason for them. Uh-oh. Oh! I don't think I should go down there. That looks like death. But who knows, maybe I was supposed to drop down there. Yeah, I don't see anything else opening up. No. Fuck it. Let's at least try that first before I waste any more time. <laughs> Come on, baby. Yippee ki -yay. Nope. Okay. We tried. Okay. It never fully loaded. That's weird. Alright, so we'll keep going. There's gonna be something over here in the back corner, probably. Because that's still closed out, I can see it. Ah, this opens. There we go. See, it was just around the corner. Saving. Must be getting near the end of the chapter, too. What the fuck? I don't think I'm supposed to do this. Okay, good. Where the fuck? <laughs> what the hell? This is fucking crazy. Oh, it got so quiet. Oh, no. Oh, fucking no. I knew it was going to be a Cthulhu thing. God damn it. Oh, I should have a field day here. To say the least. Fuck me. I've never seen such a creature. This great statue looks very ancient. That's fucking Cthulhu, my friend. He too is very ancient. The structure of the universe. This place used to be a temple belonging to our ancestors. Each temple stood at one of the entrances to the underground passages where the ruins of the ancient cities can still be found today. What? The statue represents the great ancient who appeared in physical form on the earth on the day of the event, together with the god's eye. He united with the population, birthing a new line with divine blood. From that moment, our sacred order was born. The diagram of the dome shows the structure of our universe with the outside en enveloping... Enveloping? Enveloping. And containing it. Only the gods I can show the outside, which is situated in a superior dimension where the great ancients reign. Bro, what the fuck? Yo. What the fuck? Can I go push him over? Sam. I'm kidding, I wouldn't dare. It's Trogdor. <laughs> Oh, that just opened. Oh. It looked like it was already opened. Shit. It's a trap. Oh, no. I can't run. I hit sticky keys. <laughs> This is why we get <laughs> plagues, because ancient temples being opened. I mean, honestly, not far off. <laughs> what the fuck? Can we not do that again? 
Listen, I'm just here to try to report some news. Looking for my, my Uncle Edgar. Have you guys seen him? It's locked. What do I do? 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 Fuck. I think that's scripted. It's not telling me to press left. Okay. There we are. <laughs> Where are they taking me? I don't remember anything. Oh god, I'm losing a lot of blood. I can't hold on much longer. I feel that my strength is giving out. F indeed. So, unfortunately, unfortunately, that is going to be where we leave off for the evening. Um, which sucks because, holy shit, this is getting really good. But I want to finish this up. Um, I may try a different game tomorrow. It's just It should be a quick one. Or, you know what? No. We'll play this again tomorrow. And after I beat this, I'll play the other game I was thinking of. And it's not a Dying Light 2. Don't worry. I promise. <laughs> uh, but anywho. Let me see who's on here. Because we got to be raiding some folks. And I have a lot of cool friends that stream. Um... Let's see who's actually up and around. Oh, a lot of people signed off since I went live. You know what? We like Wheeler. So, for those who like dogs, uh, my good friend Wheeler Dealer, uh, he is currently playing Valorant right now. It's a fun uh, FBS game. Kind of like CSGO in a way. I play it occasionally. Um, but anywho... All of the money he makes, every last little penny, little cent that he gets from this uh, this stream of his, he donates it to a charity that helps train service animals um, that are then given to patients that need them free of charge. And I think it's awesome. And he's a great friend. Um, so I'm going to send you all over there to Wheeler. Uh, so make sure you say hi to him. Throw him a follow if you can. Um... If you super, super can, if you have any bits to spare that you weren't going to use for me, obviously, um, definitely throw him his way because it's a pretty cool deal. Um, fun dude to hang out with. Great streamer. Um, he rages a lot too, which is pretty funny, <laughs> but it's all for fun. Anywho, uh, thank you to everybody, all the new followers, the new subs, the bits. The... I had to eat two. I ended up eating two beans bunch of streams uh game shit went out and holy fuck holy fuck i'll be back tomorrow have a great night have fun with wheeler